Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for clicking on today's video. And if you're new here, hiya, hit like. My name is Myra Murison and welcome to my channel. So as you can do by the title in this video, my Calathea or Jupertia Albertia has sprung back. And I can't wait to show you guys. So this video is going to be a recap and an in-depth update. So without further ado, please subscribe if you're new here, hit the bell to hold my channel grow, get your tea ready, and let's get into this video. So to summarize the story of my Calady Albertii, I have a plant diary video on how I take care of the plant. Uh, there were no changes on how to take care of it, pretty much the same with extra tenderness, love, and care because of what happened during the cold winter last year. So I will leave all the links that related to my Calavia Alberti eye in the description bar so it's handy for you. Okay, recap! Okay, I'm going to show you the plants that I mentioned the other day that are struggling right now. Here's my Alberti eye. It's still the same. Uh, there is no difference with this plant. Um, very needy when it comes to humidity. <laughs> And the leaves are still the same despite it's receiving rainwater. I think the main problem is the humidity. So, yeah, saying that, it's still alive and kicking. So, I'm going to take these three plants and put them all in one pot. I just feel like it. I want to make these plants look great despite the fact that they're having difficulty. The Alberti eye. This means, oh, there's a new. Oh. Maya, let's not break this. You see a new growth, guys? This one here. New growth. It's pretty cool. Here they are. I hope they're just going to be fine. Uh, they have the same care plan, so I'm not worried when it comes to watering. And I think they look great together. What do you think, guys? If you remember, I transferred three of my prayer plants into one pot as they were struggling during the winter. Uh, their leaves were getting crispy and not looking great at all. Well, they are getting worse and worse. So here they are. Look at this. Oh, leaves. My Alberti eye is not looking good at all. I think it's finally giving up. The weather is just too cold for the plants. I don't know guys. I will see what I can do. It is a resilient but at the same time it's not looking great. I have had this for a couple of years now and the leaves are just getting crispier. It's so painful to watch. Hey guys, I'm going to be honest with you. I was going to throw this Alberti eye, but then I found this baby shoot. I discovered this before, but I didn't realize it's still here. I completely forgot about it, so I think it's a sign that my Alberti eye is still trying. I decided to cut them all as the leaves are just crazy. There is no point leaving them as they were. I want my Alberti eye to recuperate if it will, so let's hope this spring this will produce new shoots like this one. I will keep eye on this and hope to god it will come back to life remember the small shoot i didn't expect it to survive but i was wrong the Calady alberti eye is such a resilient prayer plant a fighter despite the leaves browning around the edge it's still fighting i almost gave up and wanted to throw it but in the back of my mind and in my heart i didn't want to and decided to keep it and cut the brown leaves off and pray for a miracle and i'm so glad i followed my instinct and now here it is it's completely back to life guys they are just small as they are just babies but isn't it cool 
Ah, call me crazy if you're not a plant mama but if you're a plant lover like me you know exactly how I feel full of excitement proud and happy <laughs> okay all I did was just leave this plant alone it is sitting in my plant room along with my other plants and water when the soil is dry and I use filtered water from the fridge and that's it no special treatment at all uh, my grow light gave this plant a little boost every time I turn it on but this is very rare because my plant room doesn't need grow light all the time at the moment as it's growing season and the lighting condition is just fine. So there you are guys. I thought I would update you. I hope you find this video helpful and thank you for watching. Until next time. Bye!